Hi Viola community, it's Mike here. And today's video is another contest. And this time it's for Jack in Scotland. And Jack's channel is The Vinyl Voyage. And uh, he's pushing towards 500 subs. So he's decided to do a contest that will hopefully get him over. I'm sure it will, because last time I looked, he was already on 490. So Jack's not been in the vinyl community for very long, only a few months. So, you know, he's doing really well to get up to... Uh, almost 500 in such a short time. And it's well deserved too, because he's got a very eclectic taste in music. His presentations are always very good. And uh, yeah, he deserves he deserves all the subs that he can get, quite frankly. So uh, what's this contest all about? Well, first of all, the prize is a rough trade uh, voucher. And I think Jack said that if that's not convenient for you, then... Uh, he can do Amazon. I think that's what he said. Anyway, you'll have to go over to his channel and, uh, uh, and check exactly what, uh, what the prize is and, uh, uh, and all the details. But uh, it's his weekender competition because Jack says he likes a good party. And uh, what he wants us to do is uh, answer three questions. And the first one is show three albums uh, that you think will really get the party started. So... Uh, Without further ado, let's uh, get on with it. So first off, a bit of pop punk. A uh, band called uh, Cyanide Pills, and the album's called Sliced and Diced. I think it's their third or fourth album. And these guys are from Leeds, and I think they're absolutely brilliant. And uh, they're on the uh, on the lovely Damaged Goods label. That does an awful lot of uh, really good uh, contemporary punk in the UK at the moment. So... That's my first one, a bit of pop punk. I mean, who doesn't like pop punk? Okay. So that's uh, that's the first one. Second off, uh, a band that I've seen live uh, a few times. Last time was on a, a very hot uh, summer's evening at a packed Belgrave Music Hall in Leeds, and it's these guys, the Bibio Sound Machine. And uh, this is their album, uh, Doko uh, Mia, and uh, it's from 2019. And... Say so they're an Afro funk band from London and they're absolutely brilliant. You know, if you can't dance to these guys, you can't dance to anybody. There you go, there they are. Look, look at that, look at that. I mean, what's not to like? You know, lots of brass, brilliant vocalist, and absolutely joyful music listeners. So, uh, if you don't know, if you don't know the Bibio Sound Machine, then uh, you know, get out there and listen to them because they're absolutely brilliant. Lovely Afro funk, I said, you know, from London. And uh, I don't think any UK party will be complete without some music from these guys. Slade, the mighty Slade. And this is their album Slade from uh, 1972. Uh, it's my favourite album by them. Uh, it's got lots of the hits on. You've got Goodbye to Jane, uh, Mama, We're All Crazy Now. Uh, then you've got uh, Look at Last Night, which is which is a great track, track uh, How Do You Ride. It's, it's absolutely brilliant. You know, if, uh, again, I mean, Slade are a real sort of party band, I think. And, uh, you know, they're a real favourite with uh, violent community members, uh, at least in the UK. So there you go. Th th those are my three uh, party albums, Jack. So question number two. Uh Choose two members of the VC to bring killer music and vibes to the party. Well, there's quite a few of you out there that I think uh, would fit the bill. And I'll try and go with people that haven't been mentioned uh, already. So, uh, first off, uh, it's Tommy. And Tommy's in uh, Finland, and uh, his channel is uh, Tommy's Vinyl Knot. And if you've seen Tommy's channel, you know, you'd have to agree that this guy looks like he really enjoys a good party uh, absolutely brilliant guy uh, he's quite quite manic i suppose in his, his presentation but i love that but also he's very much into uh, punk rock and uh, i'd love to uh, hear, hear some of uh, some of tommy's uh, finished hardcore albums so if he can bring some of his records along to the party that would be absolutely uh, fantastic so tommy that's my first uh, vc member to bring to the party and uh, the second one is uh, my friend down there in portsmouth and that's mike 
PC31. And Mike's got great taste in music. I think he quite sort of closely chimes with the sort of stuff that I like anyway. But uh, he's also into uh, uh, you know, performing himself. He's in a Kinks tribute band, and uh, he's actually released uh, CDs himself as a solo artist. So I think it'd be really great if uh, uh, Mike could bring his uh, Kinks band sort of up to uh, the party uh, with him, and uh, we could have some live music there, couldn't we? So uh, those are my two VC members. And then, of course, you know, next morning, you know, Jack says, well, you know, you're going to have a hangover, aren't you? Sunday morning. So what music would you choose? What album would you go on to sort of, uh, you know, help uh, clear the uh, cobwebs away, help help with the hangover and everything? And I immediately thought of this one. It's an album from 1998. It's some lovely trip hop from Paul Cheever. And this is uh, their best album, in my opinion. It's a big calm. And the vocalist uh, with Paul Cheever. Sky Edwards, she's got an absolutely lovely, soothing voice, but this is really sort of chilled out music. It's absolutely lovely. So, I mean, The Sea, which is the first track uh, on the album, it just sort of uh, sets the tone completely, you know, and uh, it's just, just a lovely album to relax to and, uh, you know, to, to, to generally chill to. So there you go. So that's my uh, album to uh, uh, chill out to on the Sunday morning with The Hangover. So... I hope you like that, Jack. Everybody else, you know, go over to Jack's camp channel, give him a give him a slob, give him a thumbs up, and uh, all the usual stuff, and uh, yeah, and see what he has to offer because he's got a really good channel going there. So uh, until next time, see ya. Bye. <laughs>